Hey, what's up YouTube? Uh, sorry I haven't been that active recently. Uh, I know it took me a while to get that last video up for the boys' bed. I am super busy at work. I'm the Toys for Tots coordinator for the Las Vegas area, and I have some inspections coming up, so work's been killing me. This thing, easy to take apart, put that together is always a challenge. But I got that together and it works, which it didn't before. I found this in my grandfather's garage years ago. Never used it. I finally decided to plug it into the air hose to see if it works. It, it didn't work. Works now, so. <laughs> I got some new drills. Well, not drills. I got the drill and the uh, the driver thing. Makita. I like it. So, my long loved the Walt drill is now retired. Um, back when I lived in Illinois, I was putting a shift kit in my truck. And after I broke torque and all the uh, valve body bolts, I was using this to get the, the bolts out the rest of the way. And after that last bolt, the valve body tried to drop, but I caught it, dropped the drill into a pan full of transmission fluid, ripped this completely apart to clean it out. Uh, I had to change out the brushes in it because they were wore out and they were saturated in transmission fluid. And then uh, I kind of greased the transmission the inside and it still works if I could find the charger for the batteries. I have not found them since we moved. But I'm gonna do a tear down of that, uh, probably record it on the green mat. And uh, one of the biggest reasons for wanting to replace this, for one, this thing is long. Where is the Makita one? Found it. So if you look at these two, the, the wall is much longer, but the wall does have a three-speed transmission. This has the two. Um, I just like the compact size of it. Another issue is, this does not drill round holes. There is some run out somewhere. I don't know if it's in the chuck. We'll test that. I got a dial uh, caliper recently. So we'll test to see if the run out is on this because it is uh, weeble wobbly and it's never drilled straight holes. But I bought this in 2002 and you can see it's, it's wore out. I mean, the grip is gone from getting oil on it and grease and nasty gunk. But I'll do the video of that soon. Not much going on here in Vegas for us. I think we're done traveling for the while. Did my cousin's uh, wedding a few weeks ago. Um, we're staying here for Thanksgiving. I think we're staying here for Christmas. And I think we might go up to Reno for, for New Year's. Don't know yet. It's birthday season. That's another big thing. Uh, we have Wyatt's birthday next week. Lily's birthday in November. We just had Ava's birthday. Uh, back in September so all my money goes to birthday presents and then we have Christmas right around the corner too I'm trying to think of the next project I might do the wife wants a bench that goes in front of the bed uh, she wants to do the uh, fluffy upholstery stuff but it's got the little rivets in it I don't know she's gonna do that part I'll build uh, I'll build it for her I'm probably gonna do it out of oak hopefully uh, Turns out nice. Hopefully, I get to record that. And then my son needs a desk, and I think I'm gonna build a corner desk in his room. And uh, I'll try to get a video of that too. Other than that, 
Hopefully I can keep the content coming, at least one video a week, me doing something. If you do me a favor, reach down there, click that subscribe button, make sure you like, comment. Let me know what you're gonna wanna see. I uh, am an amateur at everything I do. I'm not a master of anything, but I do my best. So thanks for watching, I'll see you next time.